Hi everyone, this is Ricky Grove, Managing Editor at Renderosity.com, and this is News of the Week for April 22nd through the 29th, 2023. Our News of the Week video features essential news in the Renderosity community and marketplace, along with select computer graphic industry news. This week's show is sponsored by Real Illusion, creators of iClone, cartoon animator, and character creator. Visit realillusion.com. And in Renderosity community news, our Gallery of the Week is the Objects Gallery. Artists through the ages have recreated every kind of object in their work. Renderosity artists create photos, digital paintings, and 3D models in the Objects Gallery. We've chosen 10 works from this gallery to feature in the video. We also have an interview with Renderosity vendor Shauna Lorock by M.D. McCallum. Shauna Lorock creates many wonderful sci-fi related assets and sells them at reasonable prices in his colorful and practical store. M.D. interviews Shauna Lorock about his working methods and background as an artist. And in Renderosity Marketplace news, Ken Gillilan is having an Audubon birthday sale. He is a master at creating anything related to birds. He's having a sale on his work, which is top-notch. This is a great sale from a fabulous artist. I urge you to click the link and find out more. And in Renderosity Industry News, take a load off with 360-degree sky domes by M.D. McCallum. The ability to use sky domes to illustrate your scenes is a breakthrough in digital scene creation. Real Illusion's iClone makes this process easy. Click the link to learn more about creating your own 360-degree sky domes in iClone. And finally, Resolve 18.5 New Features. My favorite new Resolve updates by Casey Ferris. DaVinci Resolve is a free video editor with very powerful features. Noted Resolve expert looks at the new version of Resolve 18.5 and shares his thoughts on why this update is so cool. This is a great update and I urge you to find out more. That's our news this week. I hope you're enjoying spring. Take care. Bye-bye.